Good morning, mother suckers. Good evening, wherever the hell you're watching this. Thanks a lot for tuning in. I'm Bears G, and I got the whole squad with me. I got James, Aaron, Kenneth, and we got Tom back there with his boy. And we're gonna be fishing Liberty Station. And what the hell's going on back there? The sword fight. This guy fight. touching rods. But yeah, we're out here at Liberty Station. We're gonna try to target some Corvina, some Spotties, maybe some Mac, and uh, hopefully a smell. You caught a smell yesterday, right? Yeah. That's hella random. On the grub? On the grub. But we're out here, but if you guys are stuck at home, quarantine, dealing with this crisis, I hope you guys are safe. I hope you guys have enough supplies. I hope you guys are not one of those people that are hoarding all the damn toilet paper. You got toilet paper? Nope. Damn. No, See? We got a victim of non-toilet paper guy right here. Make so that you, too. Make that too. So if you guys are hoarding toilet paper. Let me know. <laughs> yeah. I, I'll buy some. Give me the plug, all right? Hook it up. <laughs> but uh, enough of that talking. We're just going to be out here. We're going to try to catch anything and everything, big or small. We're going to try to catch them all. So if you guys enjoy these baby videos, be sure to drop a comment. Be sure to smash the thumbs up button. Be sure to subscribe. But enough of this talking. We're going to get this morning started and uh, hopefully catch some fish. So stay tuned and let's go. Oh, I just had one. I just had one hit my top. I had one hit. Yeah, there's like a patch of grass in the middle of this. Whoa. Yeah, you see it? I keep getting hung up on like floating grass, whatever the hell it is, eel grass. Custom underspin. <laughs> huh? Damn it. Oh, whoa. What do you get him on? That's like a good one. Yeah. You just missed the what? <laughs> it don't matter. <laughs> yeah. yeah, there you go. On the grub. Any blow up yet? Okay. One at the beginning over there. It was like, it wasn't even blow up. Like, I think it was a macro head. It, no, it came up and bit it. Took me under for like 0.2 seconds. That's when you heard me. I'm like, oh. And I was like, that would have been my first top water fish of the year. <laughs> oh, the hook set was terrible. You're fired. Not good enough. There we go. On the custom underspin I made. Yeah, buddy. Show yourself. Dude, he's tugging. Ugh. Yeah, boy. There you go, on the major craft. Underspin thingamajiggy I made. Not a bad one. I'll take it. Pretty decent. This is the 2.3? Is it 2.3 or 2.3? 2.3 grub. 
seven gram head with uh, my own little spinner I added on there. This sky is beautiful. You guys can see that. There we go. Oh, it came off, dude. That was a crazy hit. Oh, the top or you switch? I switched over. I made a, oh. an, an underspin yeah. myself. Tiny spin? Yeah. That's nice. Dude, that was a crazy hit. I, was, I saw that happen. <laughs> All I'm doing is just rod tip down, crank, and I just raise it up slowly. And that's when they hit it. Dang, James. What? Is that Stinger? Is that Stinger? Oh, you went for it too. Did he go for it? Yes. Let me see. What? Dude, he went that for it. That is crazy. What? That is crazy. <laughs> what? He caught a Stingray. It actually went for the bait. What's he throwing? Grub. Oh, and I just lost the bite. I just had a bite right here. Nice. Damn. It's like a fish or what? Underspin? Oh, yeah, yeah. Made it myself. Nice. That's sick. It works, dude. Adds a little oomph to the bait. There goes that. <laughs> hey, is that my old underspin? Is that my other spin? <laughs> it is. Yep. Yeah, it is. I got my other spin back. Yeah, hey, buddy. Got him, coach. Oh, you wanted a pink grub, right? Oh, that feels good. Bird. There you go. glasses it's okay it's all right guys well liberty station was yeah i mean james killed it he got three species oh yeah stingray mackerel spotty i got a mackerel well no i didn't catch a mackerel i caught a damn spotty <laughs> but it's all good none of us skunked besides rex sorry rex i did did you yeah oh you didn't catch one yeah. oh that's okay it's relaxing. But it is nice to get the guys together and come out and fish out here in San Diego Bay or wherever the hell we go. It don't matter. It don't, don't matter. matter. <laughs> like I said, it's nice to have all the boys out and, you know, doing our thing, enjoying the view, enjoying the weather, and enjoying whatever the hell is, uh, there is out there. But we are headed off to Harbor Island. Haba Haba. Haba Haba. Yes, sir. Yeah, we're going to head over there and obviously do some more fishing. Maybe get something. Who knows? But we are cherishing every moment we can. A while we can. While we're pen, <laughs> pen, pen, <laughs> pandemic. You can't even say pen, <laughs> pen, <laughs> pandemic. During the crisis we're going through, we're trying to make the best of it, and I hope you guys are doing the same. You know, like, but follow the guidelines. I recommend it. Enough of that. Let's go. All right, all right. We are at Harbor. Why are we at Harbor? Well, we are here because we wanted more current flow, tide flow, and more bait to be moving around. So we're thinking the fish out here is a little more active 
the Liberty Station, given that Liberty Station is slacking out, so there's nothing really coming in or going out. But Harbor Island, it's wide open, and more movement in the water is what we're looking for. And that's the main goal. Like I always mention in my videos, you guys want to figure it out, figure the current, keep an eye out for bait, and maybe something will bite. Maybe y'all will get lucky and get a mackerel, because I still haven't caught one. So, enough of that talking. Let's go. Oi, mid cast. There we go. What are you? Mac. <laughs> I think so. I think this is the first Mac of the year. First Mac of the morning. Yeah, he hit it so close too. Right? Yeah, I was just like cranking him with my rod tip down. Then he just went tight and I just set it. They're slowly moving in though, I'll tell you that. We're seeing them more often now. What is it? James. It's probably a rat. Someone's pet? Maybe. Looks like it. Oh, what the fuck is that? You were in the way. I didn't even see that. Holy, Holy shit. shit. <laughs> oh, man. Let me, let me get a better angle. Yeah, I was fishing, and then I looked down. I'm like, what is that? And I was like, Ain't no bat ray. That's a furry-ass halibut. <laughs> what the hell? I thought it was a toy at first, and then, like, as I looked Grab this, Aaron. Like, you can see the That's a dog. Could be a coon. Oh, there you go. I don't know, dude. It's... Oh, gross. Is the skin coming off? No. Why, oh, you want some? Hey, <laughs> you know what? It's not a pet because there's no collar on it. I'm trying to see the face. I think it's a raccoon. Really? Yeah. It's a raccoon. Look at the tail. That's crazy. Dude. Where's my camera? It's a coon. Oh, what a sucker. That's insane, dude. I think somebody either killed it out here and threw it in. Yeah, maybe, but that's crazy. It's like, what the hell? No, I'm just saying like, I, I think someone killed it and threw it in. Right there. I ain't getting close to that. I'm gonna let nature take its course in the water. Oh, he's been there for quite some overnight easily. Nah, dude. He would have been. He would have been torn up already if it was longer than the night. I think he got killed out here. Then we're playing detective right now. All right. I think. Who did it? Who did? I think it got hit by a car. And they didn't want to call nobody to pick it up and pew. Or some fisherman was out here, thought it'd be funny to shoot it in the face with a BB gun. Give it another day, his, all his meat will be gone from the crabs and shit. Right there. Yeah, dead raccoon right there. I don't know what the hell happened to it. Probably someone killed it, got in the rock, something hit it in the head. I don't know. But all I know is that it's dead and it's stinking up this whole area. I mean, it's getting, it's floating out, but the smell is coming up. <laughs> and every time I walk down there, the smell is just getting worse and worse and worse and worse. But I did get my first mackerel. 
damn excited about that. So, Aaron. Yes, sir. Keep trying, bro. Don't give up. Oh. Look, look at that. Uh oh. He's already on. What are you throwing? Grab. Grab. The pair were in grab. <laughs> yeah. So, James hooking it. He's killing it right now. He's easily like 10 plus fish already, and he's been throwing the grub the whole time. And we attacked the top water this morning. Didn't work out too well. Some jerk bait didn't work out too well. And we just we just out here grinding, having a good old time out here in sunny San Diego. And uh, you know, out here with great company. That's all that matters. Let's see what else the day has to offer. It's all yeah. good. It's all good. We all caught fish. Yep, we are ending the day right there. Total of about 15 fish between all of us. Mostly James, because I only caught one and a half. Yeah. And Tom got one. Little man, sorry dude, skunked out, but better luck next time. Right? Don't hook yourself, right? <laughs> yeah, he caught himself. There you go. Better than what Aaron did. Aaron literally caught himself on a float tube. Went right through his finger. But we are closing out right there, guys. We're ending the day. It was a success, I oh, believe. Yeah. I mean, that's all that matters. We're all out here, good company, good people, beautiful sunny San Diego weather we got going on. Bye, I mean, it's like the first time, I know, right? The past two weeks has been, it's just been rough on us. We got storms, wet roads, dumb drivers. That's including me. Now that the weather, you know, cleared up for us, the bite didn't. We, we didn't have a good bite, but it's part of the game. It is what it is. We're out here. Getting our lines wet, and again, with dope ass people, cool people, the squad. Where? Where? <laughs> <laughs> but uh, there's nothing else to really say besides take care of yourself out there with this whole crisis we're dealing with. Again, I'm sorry for mentioning it again. I know you guys are stressing on that. So stay positive, stay healthy, stay off the streets. <laughs> stay, <humble>. <laughs> <laughs> stay six feet away whoa, from whoa, each whoa, other whoa, 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 whoa. and uh just you know just stay positive what else is there to say yeah thanks a lot for tuning in if you guys enjoyed this video give me a thumbs up consider subscribing hit the bell notification button comment below drop your thoughts and everything i use in this video again is in the description below be sure to check that out you guys keep asking me just it's, it's a little tiny arrow at the bottom just click that bam everything is there rods reels everything but enough of this talking, I want to thank you guys for tuning in, be safe, and as always, good fishing, and peace the hell out.